Like and subscribe right now, or you're going to have bad luck for the rest of the week. From crabs to shrimps and terrifying creatures like isopods, there are probably millions of animals that can't be classed as crustaceans, but not many that are as big and dangerous as the ones you are about to see. Some of them are the stuff of sea legend, so stay tuned for that. Number 10, the coconut crab. You may be familiar with hermit crabs that totter along the beach, toting their bodies in seashells. Meet their enormous relatives, coconut crabs. The coconut crab is so monstrous and intimidating that the famous naturalist Charles Darwin had quite a strong dislike for it. Well, considering it looks like something right out of a horror novel, we can't really blame him. This massive crab can grow to over three feet long and is believed to be the largest living arthropod capable of living on land. What's even more frightening is that scientists strongly believe that these titans could have been responsible for the mysterious disappearance of the aviation pioneer Amelia Earhart. Yep, there's a possibility that they might have eaten her body and dragged her bones down into their dens. The coconut crab is truly an intimidating crustacean. Aside from its domineering size, this crab is naturally juiced up, and despite clocking in at no more than 9 pounds, it can lift up to 6 times its own body weight. No need for a gym membership, eh, big fella? As the name suggests, coconut crabs snack mainly on coconuts, and that's why they have such powerful claws, to knock coconuts from branches and then dismantle those hard shells with their pincers. Number 9. Mantis Shrimp Next up, the mantis shrimp is an aggressive crustacean that lives in the subtropical and tropical waters of the Pacific Oceans, between East Africa and Hawaii. They are notorious for their strike force, which is likened to a 22 caliber rifle. Their fists are spring-loaded and can accelerate from their body at 50 miles per hour. The force is enough to smash through crab shells, and if humans had such powers, they would be able to punch through steel. There are over 450 species, with the notorious one being the peacock mantis shrimp. They grow to about 4 inches, with some recorded to be as large as 18 inches. They are solitary and, as such, spend most of their time hiding in rocks and burrowing in the seabed. They are violent predators whose diet depends mainly on the species. Generally, they eat snails, clams, crabs, fish, squid, and shrimp. Surprisingly, they even eat animals much more prominent than them. Their photoceptors are three times more effective than humans, suggesting that they are great at differentiating colors. Number 8. Isopods At number 8, we have a truly terrifying creature, the isopod. It's not so much their size, but rather how they feed on other animals in the deep blue sea. Take, for example, a large isopod that was found burrowing into a fish's tongue and eating it to the point where it actually took the place of its tongue. Interestingly, the fish survived the experience with no apparent harm other than the loss of its tongue to the parasite. But if you're a human, you probably wouldn't want your tongue completely eaten out, would you? It's not exactly the conversation starter. Uh, and the horror doesn't end there. In 2017, the world went crazy over the case of a 16-year-old boy from Australia named Sam Kinese who had his legs devoured by a swarm of scavenging isopods on Brighton Beach. Number 7. Japanese Spider Crab The fear of spiders is one of the most common phobias in the world. The chances are that you or someone you know has it. This fear isn't entirely out of place, especially when you are learning about a creature like the Japanese Spider Crab. Crabs aren't that dangerous or scary, but the species is in a world of its own. They are the largest of their kind and live longer than humans. There are confirmed cases where they chop off human fingers. Although they are not hunters, they feed on kelp, mollusks, slow-moving invertebrates, and the dead bodies of animals moving about in the water. Legend has it that they drag sailors overboard and eat them alive in the ocean depths. While this is not true, they're known to devour the bodies of dead sailors, although they're found between 150 and 300 feet down. You should be worried because they can venture into shallow waters when it is the time to mate. You may never see these decorator crabs coming your way as they are skilled in the business of disguise. Number 6. Sand Fleas Next up, we have a creature everyone hates. Sand fleas are known for names like Suthis, Juggers, Picos, or Niguas. 
The CDC says that females pose more health risks to humans. While the males feed on warm-blooded mammals like humans, their female counterparts burrow into the skin. What if I told you that humans help them reproduce? Here's how it works. When the female sand flea burrows into the skin, the males come there and mate with them briefly. After that, the eggs numbering about 100 drop to the ground and both the fleas join them. You don't even notice when all these are happening because these creatures are small. You start to develop symptoms hours later. It may result in lesions that can cause difficulty in walking. The opening caused by burrowing could expose the victim to infections, and in severe cases, the leg could be amputated. Treatment is based on the extent of the damage. They are fond of beaches across the Caribbean, South America, and Africa. Number 5. The Colorful Mosaic Crab At number 5, we have another crab on our list, but this fella right here comes in a pint-sized version. He's a member of the Xanthidae family, a group of crabs that love to live in coral rubble or near living reefs. Despite their small size, they have an elongated fan-shaped body full of red color with impressive mosaic patterns that add credence to its name. They also have black tips at the end of their pincers that easily distinguish them from other poisonous crabs. I mean, you can spot this guy from a mile away. So what makes them so dangerous? Well, according to different studies, these guys have a high concentration of lethal toxins in the gut, as well as other toxins in their shells called saxitoxins. The toxin is so powerful that gram for gram, it is 1,000 times more deadly than cyanide. If you cook this fella thinking you have a tasty delicacy of crab, think again. You might just find yourself paralyzed. And before you know it, heading straight to the morgue. Number 4. Pistol Shrimp The Alphidae, or pistol shrimp, are best known for their astounding organic weaponry. Snapping their one enlarged claw produces a collapsing cavitation bubble capable of paralyzing or killing small fish with its intense burst of sound and pressure. Impressive as their biological stun guns may be, they aren't the only thing that sets pistol shrimp apart. A few species are the only crustaceans known to live in eusocial colonies, like ants or termites with specialized reproductive reproductive queens and non-reproductive working castes. They live and feed entirely within sea sponges, keeping them clear of harmful parasites in the process. They're the bees of the sea with supersonic stings and symbiotic hives. Number 3. Gribbles Trees don't sound like the typical diet of an ocean dweller, but enough timber washes out to sea that several marine animals depend on it for a food source. Isopods of the family Limeridae are an example, having enough to feed exclusively on submerged wood. They're more commonly known as gribbles, an adorable name for something that could once doom a vessel. These little sea termites are almost as destructive as the famous shipworms. Gribbles have enjoyed a new surge of attention in recent months. An enzyme produced during their feeding process is exceptionally effective in turning wood into simple sugars, a process that could provide an efficient source of renewable biofuel if we could learn to replicate it. Number 2. Remipede Remipedes are tiny critters that resemble white centipedes. They have a long segmented body with lots of swimming legs. This creature is found in the caves of Mexico and parts of Central America. They were first classified scientifically in the 1980s, but the details were still sketchy because their terrain is challenging to work in. We know that these blind predators feed on the shrimps that make their way to the underground pools. Scientists from the National History Museum discovered that this crustacean has a needle-like fang on each side of its head surrounded by muscles that can pump fluid out. Deep inside their body is a gland that provides venom that is stored in their reservoirs. These toxins are odd compared to other arthropods. While the poisons in other spiders have neurotoxic proteins, the remipedes toxic cocktail is dominated by enzymes that break their prey's exoskeleton. Its efficacy is comparable to that of a viper, and their lifestyle and environment pressured them into going toxic. Number 1. Pram Bug Pram bugs are a group of deep-sea hunters that are often compared to the movie Alien, both in their eerily elongated heads and their gruesome lifestyle. When the time comes to rear their young, the female will hunt down a gelatinous filter feeder, distantly related to us vertebrates, and carve his body into a hollow tube. She employs this mutilated corpse as a mobile nursery, using her many paddles to steer it through the water and keep her eggs oxygenated. 
She will regularly pull prey inside the body with her tearing it apart so her young can share the meal. Yeah, nature is pretty wild, pun intended. Thanks for watching. What do you think about this list? Let us know in the comments. And if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel.